I don't know what this is. <laughs> I just found this game. It was free. I originally had something planned, but somebody wasn't able to join me. So, I had to find a quick back. I had deleted it so I could have room for something else coming out soon that I'm excited for. But, this was plan C. Plan C. I'll stop now. Anyway, like, my throat hurts even though, like, I'm running my mouth. You can probably tell from the way I'm talking I kind of sound off, but that could be me. I hate my voice sometimes. So, let's go ahead and see if we can figure out what in the world we're doing. Yeah, I moved it. That's what we did. Um, this way? Is it trying to... Uh, oh! We're gonna go this way, okay. Uh, what's this way? I gotta read all this. Oh, what is this? Causing the fishman some kind of rubbish in the net. Uh, oh, I was hoping we could turn it down so it was kind of loud. I can't turn it down. We just have to deal with it. Hey, 
just like potatoes as well. Yo, Grandma. Her feet are like a pencil. Well, if it isn't the brother's beard, what can I do for you fellas? Speak, but the question is, is it said that I hate you, dear? Know anything about maps? You found one. Hey, and the ordinary one. It's like right there. It's mysterious. The loaf shaped woman, pencil shaped woman, the lug it. I think he was silent for a moment. Then pauses to look up. Mystery, is it? Afraid I'm not a ma the imaginative type, boys. We're all friends. The ordinary and I should be through and trying to help so, so but basically this entire town is full of useless people. This is what my life has been reduced to. like that! Coughs awkwardly. Neat. Guess we'll be going then. Uh, thanks for the espresso. He tries. There's no answer.
Hasty beard, squinty. What do you reckon they're after? Dead beard brown. I don't like it. it. Has the feel of mischief about it. Mischief away. Grins brave beard, loosening the sails. Are you serious? It's dark in here. It's not a pure being cut, so I can make a firelight cuts into the darkness before I leave. There they are. I guess it's hippies. Oh, we got a trophy. Great barnacle coin. friend from whence do you come as one of the nymphs we were sailing for adventure and heroic deeds when this colossal whale fellow scooped us in explains steady beard it's really very discouraging man this game was free i don't know what's going on a man can't properly have an adventure that's seen indoors as brave beard Come on, friend. Imagine the wave. Become the wave. Advise the second nymph. The others exchange mellow glances, nodding approval. Can't say I follow the sentiment in that remark, comments Hasty Beard. But if you'll advise us how to hop off this vessel, we'll be on our way. The great Barnacle One brings us to a place we do not know ourselves. For those unwilling may depart through the fountain of the faithless as the nymph gesturing sadly toward what appears to be a hatch. And our ship, she can't fit through that. Fear not, once the great barnacle born reaches this place of promise, the people will open wide the gate, then all may go out as the gate of what? Either we escape with no ship, or wait for this creature to open his maw. The nymphs nod grandly. Time flows quickly in contemplation of the Great One's splendor. He who chooses the path of waiting is welcomed here by the fire. The brave beard's face shows an alarm. I think we need a fertile ground first. Nymphs begin to sway, but all this darkness beyond the circle of the Great One's love, you must first seek the enlightenment of. Found it! Interrupt Stacy, grab a torch and the fire before them. Uh, I mean, it can't be any weirder than the turtle worshippers in Red Dead. Barrels, left empty by the 
the morning to interrupt the work. Now, float, creep beside the boat. Men consider them in torchlight. If I were the puzzle solving sort, observed Hasty Beard, I'd call that a solution. A. They'll float, nods Steady Beard. Not so well, are we? Landsmen, arm the legs and float well enough. Hey, Nate! How's it going, dude? I don't know what I'm doing. This game is weird. <laughs> I bet you happy. I found whale worshippers. <laughs> what do we do with them? Wait, is it? Do we have to tap one? Oh, no. Men fidget for a moment as Steady Beard clears his throat. If you don't mind our intrusion, we'll wait here with you fellows. Oh, those are, those are, those are dudes. Those who follow the great one, there is no one. What? Hey, that's the plan, grins brave beard. The three men says. I don't know what these people are. They just remind they they're like the turtle worshippers. I don't I don't understand them. There's silence and then began to speak in turn. Great, wait, I was reading that! The great one okay. Genetically modified potato. Okay, now there's the as I am. The men began to nod off, not catching only a piece of the nonsensical, whatever that word is, exchange, as they fall into a deep sleep. Biodiversity. Final stop. Oh, we got another trophy. The Path of Waiting. Final stop. Please be. Well, I can't read that now. Hope the reading's gone for a minute. Deputy, this is Nathan. Nathan, this is Deputy. The long haired imps let us sleep through our stop, complains Hasty Beard, as they sail out into the sunlight. Brave Beard merely shudders. May as well see where it is we have stopped anyway. Settle on this. I don't even know what this is. <laughs> I've lost. Did you get lost? Are they stuck? Do I have to hit the question for something? What about that bird? Did that bird know my destiny? Brave beard edging away. Yeah, I'm going to pull the Moana. Stop, the voice is deep and aged as the earth itself. Men and rocks stand staring at one another. Moments pass before the creature speaks again. You are so happy. I get that a lot, okay? Something about the. I'm trying of the statement seems to be demand. You are rather large yourself. Tries to raise beer hesitantly. Thank you, rumbles the small mouth and simply. Is that a face? Is he gonna be? Would you like a 
like a flower. I'm quite good at flowers. Oh, we don't want to bother because we keep here. We get fat, but the creature is already turning us quick. Or maybe I will fetch three, Rumble, be happy to itself. The geological oddity thunders away, the men breathe a sigh of relief. Is that we follow the, the mountain? The bird did know my destiny. A flower. <laughs> then reluctantly turned from the enticing safety of their boat face the returning earthquake. <laughs> Gently the massive stone places before the world appears to be an oh dear, a tree. <laughs> Why thank you, got a safety beard, elbow <laughs> What a nice flower. Big creature being adorable. It's hard to maneuver. The creature's shoulders slumped, dejected. It has wilted. You know, I think I saw another on the far end of the island. Suggests Steady Beard. Why don't you go? I'm gonna fetch it. Brightening the mountain. Speed. Turns once more to thunder away. Or maybe three! Hasty Beard calls after him, grinning. This game is so weird. Quick, while we've a chance, he adds in a whisper, leading the way to the boat. Oh, we gotta leave him? Aww. I did too, it's really cool. Oh, we got another trophy. Quite good at flowers. This game has some pretty cool music. Uh, but let me guess it's gonna storm. As long as I'm getting by a whale again, I'm good. I don't like the looks nor the sound of that where he's steady beard over the distant rumble. I'd rather be fetching flowers with that walking rock pile of dry ground. Oh, crap. On cue, a shower of rain tumbles over them. Summering squid livers, how tasty beard, will be sunk. They fail furiously. The downpour is relentless. In the eerie gray, they seem to hear the faint kneeling of wordless song. Mermaids? The lighting suddenly illuminates. The surrounding women folk yell gray beard. There are women folk in the water. I guess we're about to find out if they're good or bad. The shadows fall closer by the light and the taste of beer jumps in. Oh boy. Of all the kelp we headed half with, the second splash halts steady beer's mouth situation. Sighing deeply, he dives after them. <laughs> Finding the dark water empty, the men quickly regret their course of action. <laughs> and we got another trophy, women folk in the water. <laughs>
get speared by that. That, that could be bad. As long as the sharks will burn. I can't move them. I guess they just have to see. They're going to find Atlantis. Well met, spirited travelers. The, the voice is deep and musical. The mermaid's probably thinking that. Where? We're still falling. What the crap is that? this day, you tell me. She continues smiling, but men nod unnecessarily. Yet, you have not seen all. If I think of anything else, I don't think I want to see it. She peered at each of them. Other paths lie untrodden behind you. If it is in your heart to seek these paths, another day awaits. I have no idea. It kind of does look like a Pokemon. Hey, see the eclipse and start nervously. Pardon my interruption, ma'am. But we no longer any vessel with which to seek them. Lost to sea, she was. She wouldn't have been lost to sea if y'all had to jump in the water. A silvery laugh ripples through the water around them. You have traveled far without her. You do not, do not be troubled. That which is lost may yet be found. Again, at the end of another path, inclining her glimmering head in farewell, the creature slips silently away into the darkness. And I guess we do too. In the quiet that follows, the men find themselves still sinking. And we got a trophy. Travelers. I was wondering that same thing. Did that did the Pokemon give us some kind of underwater breathing abilities? They're, they're, they're not on the walking now. They don't have to do more crap. It's fashion, pokey pokey. The sun. I think we finally hit land. And we're stranded. you came up this way. Birds. It is another one of the rock creatures. <laughs> yeah. Are Minecraft villagers? We left one of them. Hmm. And we've already seen what I like to do to Minecraft villagers.
house. <laughs> Open the door. Please be something good. Please have my boat. I know what that word is. I don't know what that word is. Of old tales. But she told us more to see. Brain and brain. I couldn't tell. Wait, we're, we're still going. Did we, did we get to throw the bottom in the water? We lost our boat. Wait, I thought we could just. I want to eat the bottle. Looking for, he 
because Lori just blew for a moment. Better make a good song. That all you got to say. So can I go back and talk to the other people? Were they in on this too? What about the old bird with the pencil shaped feet? Dougie! This pencil foot! You know anything about this? You you had that look in your eyes. Sure glad to see you boys back in town. The old woman greets them green. Knew you would be away long when your boat showed up without you. She turns back to her work. We tidied up here a bit, the Smith and I. I think you'll find her seaworthy. I didn't need a duck. <laughs> I feel so special. <laughs> this guy makes weird sounds. They can't be sure if this grunt sounds clear, but the does say sure. That noise, Ching. man. Ching. 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 We're glad you got a twist, Nathan. It'll be fun having you on board with us now. into the whale. Hey, we're back. Be welcome, we wayward pilgrims. Speaks one of the names. But those for who can resist us. Wait, we're, it, this is a different mission? We've awaited your return. Hard to resist when you're sucked down like a clam and stew growls Greybeard. The Great One journeys this way daily, so that through him all may one day find the place of promise. Predictably, the Neeps trade nods of approval. Will you wait with us here by the fire, or is it the way of the faithless you see? He took torch again. <laughs> Oh, 
if I touched the boat. Nothing. Nope. I guess we can't escape. We're gonna go back that way, yeah. This is as far as we can go, just playing with these things. Can we close barrels now? Can the torch light men examine the floating barrels once more? Still say we grab and get out, grunts hasty beard. They'll float well enough. Hey, but when they sail, steady beard is unconvinced. Gray beard merely snorts. I agree with that. Fish? I didn't notice that the first time around. Is that this where it's just a hole? Is that where we need to go? This thing? Okay then. Uh, that just sounded weird. I didn't like that. That'll be our exit of Gurr's Hasty Beer Eagle. Give her a is that the little hangy ball in the back of the throat? We aren't properly floated, contends a nervous steady beard. <laughs> we can't go about towns as the Lord, but without certain assurances. Rush, grunts <laughs> spray beard. Give me water and I'll teach you to carry me. Oh, do we, do we have to hit it? Bouncing at the faceless. <laughs> Great. <laughs> Give me water, he says. <laughs> Girl's hasty beard. Well, we've water, all right. <laughs> and no time to spare. Any other requests? Bravier aims a fish at his head. Shaking his head, steady beard begins resolutely to swim. <laughs> There's nothing in front of us. Where are we supposed to be going? Now, beard brother. We're just swimming. I literally just all I do is hold this so we can see in front of us. That's it. <laughs> Watch.
wonder that. Early men lost at sea. The fact that I actually downloaded this. speed them up we can go back to the village I guess that's what we need to do stay with you. So I don't want to be stuck in the middle of nowhere. How long, ow, how long did we actually just swim? We're just gonna stay here. Now see here, it begins to here. Last time we sat with you fellas, you lost most our stop. How you know, how do we know we trust you? Sid friends, the great one, all are worthy. Trust the unworthy. What? Rivers going to find through this once more. There's silence and the nymphs begin to speak in turn. But then the great one, 
There is only what is. Before the great one, all nothingness, this is nothing. Young people kind of creep me out a little. The great one, bring. I was reading that. And I think we fell asleep. Final stop. Please exit through the front with your belongings. Uh, I think they let us miss our stop again. Again, bellows hasty beer as they sail out. I'm wringing their pasty blue necks. At least we found land. Is that a rock friend? Rock friend! Again, men and rock sand facing one another, and then suddenly a general chaos breaks out. Small bean! Booms the small one, and you have come back. Can we just stay here? The men step forward tentatively. Hello oh, again, big fell up against Braybeard. How how are the flowers? Flowers, shouts the rock. Sand. Shall I fetch one? Shall I? Casey Beer faces back. Oh, would you? Before he finishes, the rock is already no feet away. safety of their boat to face the earthquake. I guess it's the same thing again. Really mouse don't stick. Yep, and up in the tree. Why thank you, ghost tasty beard. I want to see your rainbow. What a nice flower. A big creature of bees. It's so cute! The creature's shoulder slumps. Dejected. It has wilted again. Oh, that's another. Turn with the mouth, the creature takes stumpy way, then stops. They will grow back, the creature suggests, turning back. After the first protest, the big creature shrugs and continues on. As he thunders away, they breathe a sigh of relief. Quick, whispers the tasty beard. Aww. They did that themselves. I wanted to stay. I guess it's gonna start raining again. Is it with this place? Shouts Braybeard over the rumble. I'm starting to think old man Thunder has a quarrel with Beard. When the rain tumbled heavily over them, they began to hear the familiar wordless horse. The mermaids are back. Ariel and her sisters have returned! <laughs> the 
Flash and Lance drawing an exclamation from Greybeard. It's them, he yells, rushing to the side. The women folk. Yeah. The other two splashes quickly follow the first. <laughs> and once again, we're falling. Travelers? It's the Pokemon! So you, you have sought new paths to this day, she smiles. The men nod unnecessarily. Yet still others lie untrodden behind you. Her gaze is deep, searching. It is well, for you bear the look of those who would seek them. May we meet again, at the end of another path. Inclining her glimmering head in farewell, the creatures slip silently away into the darkness. I wonder if we actually can find land if we just let them swim. They've been swimming for an awful long time. Once again, we have found land. It really is. I still think my favorite noise is that guy's hammer in the blacksmith shop. I hear the Minecraft villagers. I want to bother some of the birds, though. Okay. 
Amen. Should we let them swim? See how, see if they go anywhere? Somebody does. <laughs> if I read all this, just get the stupid stick. The way of the faceless. Bye. Now we don't have to get out of here that way. No, it's so creepy. Snatch the uvula. I love when they just get shot out. So funny. That'll be our exit. Sorry about all this. And give her a tug. Why do he's literally burning it with a torch? He says, Stop. Help me. <laughs> yeah, 
It's funny if they did. hit land? here watching the swim.
funny story about that. I didn't charge my phone today. We'll just send them back to the village. I was really tired of watching them just swimming. Well, I guess that was Burmy Minute Sleep. That game is weird. But if you enjoyed the video, you know what to do. Follow us on Twitch, Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram at GamerGibbs54. Also, you can subscribe to our YouTube channel, which is GamerGibbs. If you're watching this from the YouTube channel right now, don't forget to subscribe. Turn on that notification bell so you never miss when we upload a video. I'm kind of glad that was over, to be honest, because that was too much going on at once. For such a weird game, I'm just glad it was free. I, I wouldn't have paid for that, to be honest. But... As always, I hope you all have a wonderful rest of your night or rest of your day, depending on where or when you are watching this video. Keep on keeping on, everybody. And until we come back together to embark on another crazy adventure, bye-bye.